Make her feel welcome to the very funny, the very talented Amanda Brooke Perrin! junk in the trunk. <laughs> Sounds like it. Uh, for those of you that don't know, it's it's kind of an, a nice way to describe a woman's voluptuous backside. Uh, it's also kind of a nice way of saying, you look like you have a lot of garbage in your ass. <laughs> right? People will be like, oh, we should work out sometime. In other words, we should have a garage sale to get rid of all that junk. <laughs> But I came up with a better way to say it. All I say is, damn girl, your ass looks like a crazy episode of Hoarders. <laughs> oh, dear. Funny to lie. I got this new alarm clock, but it's making this really weird noise. It's like, Amanda, it's 12 in the afternoon, you're such a disappointment, move out. <laughs> My mom's awesome. <laughs> she always asks me about the good news or the bad news first, though. I've always hated that. I'd rather just, like, compliment me and then hit me over the head with the bad news, you know? I told her that. She's like, okay, Amanda, you're pretty. Stupid. <laughs> <laughs> My mom likes to play a game called Get Amanda Shitty Souvenirs from Places I Don't Give a Shit About. <laughs> She played this game when she went to Palm Springs and she brought me back a t-shirt that said, Who let the geckos out? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna wear that shirt. <laughs> uh, and I feel like vacation t-shirts are kind of like illegal immigrants. Hear me out. Um, <laughs> you hide them in your closet till you need them for chores. <laughs> You're always embarrassed when your friends see you with them. You set them on fire when you're done with them. You are rude people. Uh, hey, did you guys know that it is socially inappropriate to bring balloons to funerals? I didn't. Uh, I feel like the Hallmark is missing out on a great business opportunity. So I took the liberty of writing down some slogans for some balloons to bring to funerals. <laughs> Sorry you're feeling deflated. <laughs> Going up. <laughs> that blows. <laughs> and sorry we couldn't helium from the doctors that killed your husband. <laughs> I want my funeral to be as sad as possible, so I'm planning it right now. Uh, I'm deciding on the music though, and I'm either gonna go with Spice Girls Viva Forever, heart wrenching, or an entire Nickelback album. <laughs> Tear inducing for different reasons. Hey, you guys. If you wear glasses but you only have one eye, are the glasses half full? <laughs> I saw this girl the other day. She's wearing like a gigantic belt. It basically covered her whole torso. And I was like, oh my god, I love your belt. It's so cute. Where did you get it from? And she was so rude back. She was like, I broke my back. <laughs> and I was 
like, okay, that's not what I asked. <laughs> Uh, I'm on Facebook. You guys should add me, Mandy Brooke Parent. Um, I have a lot of people that I don't have on my Facebook from so long ago and that I don't even think about. But I have this woman, and her status update one time was, I dropped my apple today. It's gonna be one of those days. <laughs> it's like a normal day. <laughs> so on my status update to stir shit up, I was like, I took care of that pregnancy problem. It's gotta be one of <laughs>